immerse yourself in the mysterious world of the Donna Brown case. Where did Donna Brown, an apparently ordinary lady, go? She disappeared on a cloudy night and whether of her own free will or because she was abducted has been unknown for years. Mutual acquaintances have suddenly become suspects, each with their own hidden agenda. Unresolved issues leave permanent scars on a community and break down trust. As we make our way through this maze of mysteries, one question remains. Does the Donna Brown case continue to provide tantalizing puzzles or has its hidden truths finally revealed? Let's dive deeper and find out what exactly happened to her. In the depths of a sultry summer's eve, a fateful encounter unfolded on August 23, 1995. Donna Winger, a mysterious traveler, embarked on a journey from the enigmatic St. Louis International Airport. Little did she know that her path would intertwine with that of Roger Harrington, a shuttle driver with secrets hidden beneath his stoic facade. As the wheels of destiny turned, their destinies collided, forever altering the course of their lives. The enigmatic tale begins to unravel as Donna Winger's arrival in Springfield becomes a pivotal moment in a web of intrigue and mystery. In a shocking turn of events, the Wingers found themselves compelled to lodge a complaint against Harrington's employer. Allegedly during their ride, Harrington engaged in a conversation that left Donna feeling quite unsettled. Whispers of discussions about indulging in mind-altering substances and partaking in unconventional gatherings began to circulate, leaving everyone wondering what truly transpired during that fateful journey. In a chilling turn of events, six days elapsed before Mark Winger made a fateful call to 911. His voice trembled with a mixture of fear and desperation as he confessed to a shocking act, the life-altering decision to end Harrington's existence. But what led Mark to take such drastic measures? When Harrington's dark wrath finally reached its boiling point, he attacked Donna with a hammer in their formerly tranquil home. The details of this terrifying story are sketchy at best, allowing us to speculate about what happened. The authorities first believed that Harrington had broken into the winger's home and brutally assaulted Donna for some unknown reason. Some have hypothesized that Harrington's employer retaliated against him because he and the Wingers made a bold complaint. However, Wingers' continuous probing into the matter, even after its claimed closure, caused investigators great anxiety. He ignored the odds and kept going. The investigator said in a whisper, his voice tinged with suspicion, I couldn't shake the feeling that he was desperately prying into our every move. Police were fascinated by what they found upon closer inspection of the scene. Winger's plan took a dark turn when he cleverly arranged a made-up story to blame Harrington for the approaching disaster. The weight of a murder accusation threw a shadow over his own life as his name got inscribed in the annals of infamy in the depths of a terrible crime in the year 2001. The carefully presented evidence at the trial of secretly recorded talks between Winger and Harrington revealed a terrifying meeting arranged on the day of the terrible killings. Contradicting Winger's assertions of a loving hug with Donna before their arrival, the paramedics reveal shocking details of their terrifying meeting with her. Schultz's testimony reveals a frightening web of deception as Winger reportedly tries to entangle her in a criminal plot, and this is just the beginning. We are left wondering how evil Winger is after hearing him say that killing Donna would make things better. In a terrifying twist of fate, Winger was put at the mercy of a jury in May of 2002. The chilling details of Donna and Harrington's first-degree murders resonated across the courtroom, proving beyond a reasonable doubt that they had been murdered. The full force of the law crashed down on Winger when he was given a life sentence without the chance of parole. The Donna Brown mystery has been solved, but it does leave us with a question. What can we learn from this process of rediscovery in a world full of uncertainties and other mysteries? Do not forget to share your views and opinions 